Well, this morning on Daybreak, Rochelle Peart breaks down the science behind one of the coolest celestial events of the year. Let's take a look. We've made it around the sun one more time, everyone. Yet, there's another heliocentric event happening soon after New Year's Day. Tis the season to get a little bit more cozy and a little bit closer to the sun. This week marks our closest approach to our nearest star and it's called perihelion. The word derives from Greek peri, meaning close, and helios, meaning sun. So Earth has an elliptical orbit and will reach our farthest point, aphelion, in early July. Now this orbit actually changes shape over time due to gravitational forces from the planet and even the moon. Now this means that perihelion will be on a different date and time next year than it is this year. And fun fact, the December solstice in perihelion actually fell on the same date all the way back in 1246. Variations in orbit are measured on a scale from zero to one and called eccentricity. So a value of one means that it's more elliptical while a value of zero means a circular orbit. Well, if you have something you want Rochelle to look into, send her an email or reach out on social media.